what's up YouTube, Jeff back from SammyGuru.com and today another very exciting Samsung video for you guys. Today we're talking about the One UI 8 stable rollout schedule and yes, we finally have leaked information about when to expect this update. Everyone's been asking about it. Samsung originally said they would have this update available in September 2025 for at least the Galaxy S25 series and now we actually know when in September this will start rolling out and also which dates will follow for other devices. I'm going to talk about that today. Before we get started, I do want to remind you guys, make sure you check out the website, sammyguru.com. That's where you can get all this information first as it is breaking because we usually cover it in written form before I have time to make videos discussing things like this just because this type of information, usually when it's breaking, it's just a lot faster to write up in written form. You can also get in our mystery box program. Check out that orange banner at the top. If you tap on that orange banner, You'll get taken to the mystery box page. You can get a free case cleaning kit, desktop phone stand, and for the S26 series, if you're purchasing an S26 Pro, S26 Edge, or S26 Ultra, you'll be able to get a free case cleaning kit, 65 watt charger in every box this time for the first time ever. You can put in your phone number, email, or both. Uh, it is US only for shipping purposes. All you have to do is use our affiliate link to order. We cover all the shipping costs. Uh, no additional cost to you. We do this to obviously help fund the website and the YouTube channel here, but also give back to the community at the same time. No one else does this that I'm aware of, so we're really proud of this program. If you guys want to check it out, the link is in the pinned comment description below. So let's go back to our article here, Leaked 108 Schedule. So I'll preface this with two things. One, we got this from Alpha Turk on X, who gives us a lot of great tips at Sammy Guru, and we really appreciate his tip here. Um, that's the first thing. The second thing is, this is a Turkish schedule, as you could probably guess by the last part of his X handle, uh, that is where he's based, I believe, and so a lot of the stuff he gets comes from Turkey. So this is a leak schedule based from Samsung Turkey, so keep that in mind that certain regions, even the US, may not follow this exact schedule, but at least gives us an idea of what Samsung is thinking. So if you take a look here, like I said, Samsung said that we're going to get the updates in September. And so if we look at the schedule, it looks like the very first set of devices, S25, S25 Plus, S25 Ultra, will see the update on September 18th, 2025. Now, what's very interesting about this, and we actually talked about this on the most recent episode of the Sammy Guru podcast, is that the S25 Edge is not lumped in with the S25, S25 Plus, and S25 Ultra. It's actually lumped down here with the next wave on September 25th, which also includes the entire S24 series, including the S24 FE. This kind of made sense to me, or I kind of figured this would happen just because the S25 Edge released in May of 2025. It did not release with the other S25 devices. And in addition, it never had a proper beta release. So the fact that this is in the second group makes a lot of sense. Now, S23, uh, S23 users, you guys are not unfortunately going to see this update in September. These are the only devices, S25 and S24 series, we'll see it in September. October 2nd though, we get another wave, which is all the S23 devices, including the S23 FE. And then the S22 uh, devices here get uh, Ultra 22 Plus S22 on October 6th. I don't know if this is a typo, but it says the S21 FE 5G gets the update on the second. I think this might be the sixth that we either translated something. Remember, this is in Turkish, but I'll definitely double check that. Um, Z series, Z Fold 6, Z Flip 6, October 2nd, which I really kind of feel like is a little bit of a besmirching to foldable users because the S24 series gets it a week earlier. Fold 5 and Flip 5 on the 13th, and then the Fold 4 and Flip 4 on the 6th. Again, we did our best to translate this information from the screenshots Alpha Turk shared. I don't know if these should actually be flipped. It's very possible, but again, I mean, these leaks also are not necessarily specific to every region, but it gives us an idea of what Samsung is thinking. Then we've got the A series, the A56 and A36, which were released this year, get it on September 25th, along with the S24 series. The rest of them in October, stretching all the way till October 30th around Halloween, for the A35 and A34, um, and then A17 and A16, both on October 2nd. So some variation definitely in the A series. And then the M series and the X cover series extend even later. Of course, you're getting into some of these budget phones and then more niche tablets going to November 10th for the X cover 7 Pro. 
Looking at the flagship tablets, Tab S10 series is going to get it on October 1st, which is pretty good for considering it's a tablet lineup. Obviously, if you want one UI 8 now, you can get it on the Tab S11. And I can tell you, if you're thinking about purchasing a Tab S11, maybe you should hold off. I'm going to make some videos. I think the main allure is actually one UI 8, but you'll be able to get that on a Tab S10 device soon. So why buy a new tablet if the new software is the real selling point? Um, you can see here all the way through the S10 FE Plus and S10 FE Plus 5G and SS10. These actually released this year. They don't get it until October 9th. Tab A9 on November 5th, you see there in that category. And then the Galaxy Watch series with One UI 8 Watch. We've got Galaxy Watch 7, Watch 6 Classic, Watch 6, Watch FE on October 1st. And then the rest of these series, starting with the Watch 5 Pro down to the Watch 4 in early November. So like I said... Some of these, not necessarily all accurate, but again, we did get this information from Alpha Turk on X. Definitely check him out. Um, if you guys aren't following him already, he's a great source of Samsung software news. I'll definitely put a link to his profile below. Let me know what you guys think. I mean, it's kind of what we expected mid to late September for the S25 series with everything kind of falling behind. Let me know if you see your device on the list or if you have any other questions in the comments below. Check out the website, bookmark the website. You can also set us as your preferred source for Samsung news in the Google News um, search engine, which helps us out a lot. We have a tutorial on how to do that below if you're interested. Appreciate you guys checking out the video. And of course, I'll see you in the next one. Thanks so much for watching.